Hey guys, so today I'm going to do this tutorial. It's a very light, um, kind of a golden neutral look. And it would be perfect for every, an everyday look or if you wanted a lighter look for a prom or if you wanted um, just something to wear that's really easy and takes not a lot of time. And it's really easy, it's really affordable. It's from the drugstore and it's this palette from Rimmel London and it's in Safari, or Sun Safari. So, um, and all, I didn't even use brushes for this, so all you need is just this palette, and then if you have an eyeliner, and mascara. So, I hope you guys all enjoy this tutorial. Okay, first we're starting off with a primer, like always, and I've already done this step, but you just put it on, and then I always set it with a powder, and I always use Avon's Pest Powder. And then, for this, it's really important, since we're going to be using lighter colors, to use some kind of base. You can either use NYX Jumbo Pencil, or you can use any kind of, since I'm using neutrals, more colors like um, goldens and browns and stuff like that, you want to use, it's better, it'll show up a little bit better if you use um, something like this. This is a cream shadow, but you can use it as a base, and it's in Frothy Mocha, and it's from Avon, and it works really well, and they're pretty inexpensive. Or you can also get something like this, this is Wet n Wild, this is also really inexpensive, and you get this at the drugstore. And it's just um, called Idle Eyes, and it's in Pixie 130. So you can use either of those. But I'm just going to go ahead and use um, this base. So what you're going to do is you're just going to put it on your finger and rub it all over the lid. And you want to make sure you spread it out evenly and stuff because you don't want it to crease during the day. Okay, and after that we're going to take this palette, and this is Rimmel, and this is in the Color Rush Quad Eyeshadow, and it's in Sun Safari. And to make this even easier, so if you guys don't have brushes, you can just use what came with it. And this is what came with it, this little thing right there. So we're going to take this color first, and put it all over the lid. Then we're going to go ahead and take this top color right there, and we're going to put that in the outer corner, just to darken up the corner just a teensy bit. And then we're going to bring it into the crease. Okay, the last part is you're just going to take this bottom corner right here, that bottom color, and you're going to put that in the inner corner, or inner tear duct, I should say, and bring it down under the waterline. You're also going to put that color up on as your highlight. Next, I'm taking this liquid liner, and I'm just going to line the, um, just a normal line on the top and this I'm just, I like using liquid liner because it lasts longer. This look would also look good if you used a smudge liner on the top, but today's I just wanted to use a liquid liner. So um I would also you know do a smudge look if you'd like to. I'm just getting the excess um moisture off the waterline and then I'm gonna use a gel liner for the bottom water line. I'm going to curl my lashes and then apply my favorite mascaras. Um, this look would also look really good with false lashes because it is such a, um, a neutral light look that it would uh, make the eyes look bigger if you used false lashes. I'm not going to just because uh, where I'm going today I don't need false lashes. So, But if you're going to like a prom or something like that or going out for the night, then false lashes would be a good idea. Okay, the eyes are done, and all I did for the lips, I added this lipstick from Avon, and it's in Cozy Mauve, and this is what it looks like. It's just a pretty, um, kind of a light reddish color, but it's really pretty. 
And yeah, it's a simple, easy look, and it only takes a couple minutes. So I hope you guys all enjoyed this tutorial, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye!